don't even know how I'm feeling right now. I can't believe I found the strength to tell you to stay away somehow. But I was tired. Tired of being number two. Hell, I wasn't even that. Everyone else seemed more important than me to you. And what's funny is that the people you put ahead of me treat you like dirt. Then you come to me complaining after your feelings get hurt. I'm not saying I'm perfect, but I always treated you with respect. There were a couple times here and there that I didn't, but it was always because of feelings of neglect. You've told me yourself I'm the best that you've ever had. You got a funny way of showing it. How come you treat me so bad? I'm not saying you're a monster, but you're definitely not a man. I've done all that I can do, and it's time for me to take a stand. I'm tired of telling you what needs to be done. And I can't believe that after all we've been through, that this is where we've come. There was a time that the thought of living without you was too much for me. But being with you was like being in bondage. And it's time for me to set myself free. Free from all the disappointments and all the lies. Free from all the times you made me cry. Free from worrying about the next time you decide to leave without saying goodbye. Free from continuously wondering why. I'm not even mad right now. I don't feel anything. I'm numb. My heart is frozen. And because of you and your disrespect, a different path needed to be chosen. My heart no longer beats because of you. It lacks emotion. I guess it's because I cried enough tears to fill an ocean. But I'm not going to cry anymore. You're not worth the energy or my tears. My biggest regret besides a frozen heart is that I can't get back the time I wasted for so many years.